I have gadgets that would literally give you superpowers. Real quick though, we hate liars, so be honest here. When you were younger, did you secretly think you had superpowers and would try to do it? Like, I'll tell the truth, maybe, maybe I did, so leave a like on the video and comment which superpower you wish you could have. Anyways, let's start with number 5. Everyone loves the idea of having an awesome robot suit. I mean, there's a reason why Iron Man is one of the most famous superheroes of all time. The good news is, a Japanese tech company has actually made one in real life, and it's almost as cool as the comic book version, but falls a little short. Okay, so maybe it can't fly or shoot power blasts out of its hands, but it can make the wearer 10 times stronger than they were before. Not just that, but it works by reading the electrical signals on the surface of your skin, figuring out like what your muscles are going to do before they even do it. Like it knows exactly how much force to use and exactly how fast to go just by reading your body, which is pretty cool if you ask me. So what's it for? Well, at the moment, it's mostly being used to help disabled people and people going through physical rehab. With that said, it could also be used to assist emergency vehicles like the police or the fire department. And the company has even said it might be fun to see them used for entertainment purposes too. Number 4 For a lot of kids, being able to climb up walls like Spider-Man is the ultimate dream. And I bet that applies to uh, some other people too, aka me, please Spider-Man, please bite me. <laughs> okay, anyways, getting bit by a radioactive spider is pretty unlikely, so you're gonna need another way to make your dream come true. Luckily, college students have invented a machine that lets you scale any solid surface, using the power of vacuum cleaners. I know, I know, it doesn't sound very cool, but if you want to climb up walls, then it gets the job done. Basically, it uses two paddles that are vacuum sucked to the wall, and to climb, you just move them upwards one at a time. It even has holds for your feet to go in, so you're not just dangling like an idiot while your arms do all the work. The only thing is, the students don't seem to want to test it without, uh, you know, safety cables, so unless you already have superhero levels of invincibility, you might want to hold off on trying it for now. Number 3 So most of the items on this list would turn you into a superhero, but if you'd rather be a super spy Tom Cruise dude, then this one is for you. I mean, on the outside, this suit looks 100% normal, but it has a secret that any spy will be grateful to have. It's bulletproof. Like, the suit was designed for businessmen who work in dangerous industries, or who have to travel to a lot of unsafe places for their work. The best part is, it's super fashionable and doesn't look like a bulletproof vest at all, so it doesn't let anyone you interact with know that you might be in danger. With all that said, a suit like this will set you back over $20,000, so unless you're secretly Bruce Wayne or James Bond, I'm not sure many people could afford it. Plus, if you do happen to get shot, then the surface fabric will definitely rip, so it's not like you could wear it again without taking it back to be fixed. It even looks like a nightmare to clean. I mean, no one wants to throw a $20,000 suit in the washing machine, am I right? $20,000 suit. It is. Does that not make you flinch at all? There's no price on uh, safety, and uh, the value of my life and the, the life of my the value of my life to my family. Number two. Now I know everyone has a favorite superpower, but I think we could all agree that throwing fireballs from your hands is pretty epic. I mean, no matter who you are, there is no way you could try shooting flames out of your hands and not have fun. Here's the good news, you don't have to wait for some kind of freaky mutation or tragic backstory to give you those powers, you can just buy them. It's actually pretty cheap too, because the ability to shoot fire out of your wrist will only cost you $147. So to be fair, the gadget is mostly used by magicians, I mean, it gives you like a quick blast of fire that hides whatever trick you're doing. However, this double barrel fire shooter allows you to set off too many fireballs at once, and you could use it over 600 times before it needs to be recharged. Plus, if you're kind of nervous about the whole thing, then you can set it off remotely from up to 30 feet away, which makes it a great gadget for pranking your friends. Okay, so if you've ever wanted to take your Iron Man cosplay to the next level, or just want to play around with a real working laser glove, then you really need to get yourself one of these, which makes our honorable mention spot. I mean, this guy made a replica of the Iron Man gloves from the second movie, but there's so much more than just a costume. I mean, they have two lasers, a main blue one in the palm like a blaster, and a smaller red one that's supposed to be for, like, cutting through things. Now, to be fair, this one won't cut through metal doors or help you blast through walls, but they do have some pretty cool party tricks. Like, both of these lasers can pop balloons basically instantly, which seems like it would be an awesome thing to mess around with. 
However, in my opinion, the coolest thing is that they could also burn wood and carve words into the skin of an orange, which makes them easily powerful enough to impress all your friends and make them jealous. Number one. So I know we started this list with a robot suit, but uh, let's be real here, ending it with one isn't a bad idea. Basically, the guys who came up with the Cyberdon HAL robot suit also have something different up their sleeve, and I think it might be even cooler. The idea is, as well as a robot suit that can read your body signals, they've also created a helmet that could read your mind. Well, I guess not quite yet, but it can read your brain signals by measuring the brain blood content of your head. Not only that, but the helmet can display activity too, as it uses colored lights to show what's going on in different parts of your brain. It's up to you whether you think this is really, really cool or really, really creepy, but I guess it's more like a super villain gadget than like a superhero one. Either way, it can still be used to help a lot of people, like those suffering from mental or physical illnesses, and if you ask me, doing good is what having a superpower is all about. And there's a video on the top 5 gadgets that will literally give you superpowers. If you enjoyed the video and you want to go buy your own, I mean, feel free, you could probably try to Google them, I'm sure they're really expensive or whatever, but uh, like I said, hope you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, it's free. With that said, thank you for watching, and we'll see you all in the next video.